What's up, everybody? It's Prophet Gaming 77, and we're back with another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. If you were following the series, um, we just ended the main story in the last episode, and unfortunately, Arthur Morgan is dead. And now we're playing as John Marston, and this is the epilogue. Um, so I'm going to continue the parts. Like, it's going to be part 32, obviously. Um, but this is actually going into the epilogue, which I did the research, and it's about six hours long. So... Let's waste no time, guys. Let's get right into it. All right, guys. So we're going to look for. So it's TD. Who else is there on this map? Oh, I guess that's it. TD. Let's go to TD Bank. Let's go to TD. I might need a horse. What the? Oh. All right, let's get it. Hey, Bob. Hey. Come on. I like this horse. I'm claiming it for myself. I'm claiming it. Yep. This is my horse. I like it. No, no. Oh, Good. Be proud of yourself. It's my horse. Hey, fella. Good, 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 good. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Huh? Who's a good boy? You are, you are, yes, you are. Milton, Yo. get over here. What's up, G's? Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. Mm -hmm. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm -hmm. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, <laughs> Milton. John, Jim. Thank you. For the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest. You'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. <laughs> hey. Hey. Get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here. Something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Oh, God. What do we got going on here? Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say, is that your family getting in the wagon up there? Oh, I believe it is. That's them. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? Mm -hmm. That you ran off those hired guns? That's Look, what I do. Can we, uh... Not discuss this in front of my wife. Oh, uh, no, you're sure. Yeah, of course, mister. <laughs> I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. That's what we do, man. Mrs. Milton. Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. Why would you say his first and last name? That's so awkward. Okay here. It's ranching work. This Jim. place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, She's you're always done telling here. Him. Come on out and lend a hand. What's our going to milk the cows. Okay. On, I'll do it. You <clears throat> are gonna milk the cows? Don't sure. get kicked in the face. Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was uh What? I'm a ranch hand. A new one at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Want nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellas. So, where are you from anyway, partner? Around, you know, up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, 
It ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Oh. Hmm. Just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having hmm. a ranch hand like you around. That I was a gunslinger, sure. though, that's for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. Yeah, bum. <laughs> All right, then. Here's the cows. So... This is the cow, eh? This is boring. <laughs> you want me to milk a cow? Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. What happened to them? Most of them drifted off. Okay. You scared them off? You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. All right, we're going to milk some cows, now. yeah. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Mm. It's easy, right? So you say, it's like you're kicked in the face. Almost got a pail full. Oh. One, then the other, Jim, that's how it goes. Milk. Yummy. Got to sell some butter. He's going in. Hey, Pa. Is that your boy? Sure. Hey, <laughs> Lancelot. Well, hey, Lancelot. Hey. We're gonna make it's a like a ditty party. <laughs> I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Yeah, you, you, you. Draining them dry uh, like a ditty party. Sure. Okay, more activities. Oh, I can't wait to get to get past this part. I'm not into the old these activities. I just want to get past this part so I can sling gunsling. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got, I got imaginative parents, sir. I can tell. Now it ain't pleasant work, but it's got to be done. Mr. Dickens said, I know what he said. We'll do it. Won't we, boy? Mm -hmm. Better not be for no 50 cents, though. But $50. An hour. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. What? Okay. Jack, let's just try and take some pride in this work. Hard as it may be. Boy. Bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to manure. You. Yes, sir. Come on, boy. So we gotta clean manure. Like, what is this, man? I wish yeah, I didn't have to do this. Way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. That's disgusting. God, Hold I gotta on. do this. Not fun. This horse shit. This job is horse shit. I'm literally Guns scooping horse shit into a barrel. Shoveling. Great. Shoveling shit. Please, pa. What? What, boy? Thank God. Ugh. 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 They could use that for our fertilizer, I guess, right? They can use that for fertilizer, right? Think your mother's hiding somewhere, laughing at us? More shit. Reckon even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check on her. Yeah. Okay. Let's go see Mama, the hot Mama. Who's my horse, man? <laughs> Who's my good old boy? Hey. Hey. Where's Jack? Don't worry about Shoveling it. Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want? 
<laughs> you want. Same as I've been. Won't do him no harm. I uh, know. Sure, woman. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Be a little better than survive for once. Okay. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, what do you know? All right. Me too. But a, a moment of intimacy. Love it. Mm. But still no John Ar Ar Arthur Morgan. He's dead now, man. Hock a doodle doo. I'll put some coffee on. Ooh. <laughs> My dude's in his jammies. So what now? Let's see what the next mission is. Three dollars. I am rich, guys. I am so rich now. TD. Let's do TD. Then we're going to do DG. Yes. We will do. I hope they make a, a Red Dead 3, man. I just. I need that. Come on, bub. Me and you. We're bonding. We are bonding. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. We're going to name you. Good horse. Love this for us, man. Already. Hey, Milton. Yes. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. What do you need? Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single handed. He's on to me. We all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? Looking for work? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. Well, it sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. Okay. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. Mm. But I will work hard, and I learn fast mm. okay give me a hand with this fence all right what you need man that's it yep there's plenty more to do okay you got it boss pound it in there we don't want it coming down how about I pound your wife in there? Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Okay. Choose a notch and put it in. Okay. Oh. Got now, it. Lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Boom, now sucker. The next rail. Yeah, 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 whatever. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Good. Okay. You made a fence. Are you taking a fence at this fence? Mm -hmm. You're doing all right. Man, I do this. This is what I do, homie. Happy now? That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. Yeah, sure. I hope you grasp the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. Shut up. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Okay, buddy. Whatever you say. I'm glad we don't have to do this all day. He's working hard. Boy ain't playing. That looks like honest work, man. He's doing honest work. He's not used to that. <laughs> You're not robbing, stealing, and killing. Shit, egg. Jim Mill, what? Here. Come in. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. Man, shut up, man. Where you at? I mean, what a bum. Can I help? Can. Come on, son. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us what a hand. What do you want, man? What do you want? Know much about bulls, Milton? 
Uh, you know? Just the basics. I know you're bull. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Howdy. Angus is your boss's son. Nice my to meet you. My second boss. Let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Great guys. You dumb asses. Uh. Although I got him. Chats over here. Maybe I should shoot his ass. No. I gotta build that. What? I don't get it. This is harder than I thought. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. Come on, baby. It ain't so bad. Hmm. Nice and easy now, boy. Whoa there. Whoa there. Easy. Easy. There, there. Mm -hmm. There, there. You're an angry one. All better? Okay. Now come on, you hunk of Chuck. You're lucky you didn't kill anyone. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. Mm-hmm. Where's your wife so I can tame her too? <laughs> I mean, what a bomb. Make that coffee, honey. Hey. Hey baby. Ooh. I'll get the coffee on. Oh yeah. Thank and then we can get it on. Right. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? Oh, yeah. To stay out of trouble. Where doing? are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. Cleaning at the doctor's Bye. office. Bye. <laughs> I think she's going to get napped or something, and he got to go after okay, her. Pa. That's what I'm thinking. See you later. She's going to go to work. Someone's going to recognize her. She's going to get napped, and then we got to save her. All right. Let's go over here. To DG. No more horse shit, please. No more horse shit. I'm done with the horse shit, please. What the hell? D Jizzle. Well, my other hand. Damn it, Abe. Abe? Mr. Geddes. You got an answer for me? I got something for you. Wow. I said, Abe, yes, sir. where are the other hand? I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to foal, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? Mm. No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Nice. So, where are we going to find these horses, man? Come on, he's over here. All I'm right. good. You get off. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Because since you showed up, runaway horse has been the sum of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, 
Is that what the boss was doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for uh, mm -hmm. business. Oh. What's it for? Uh, okay, then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get to. Thanks, kid. So. Hold on. Hold on. All right, all right. You Duncan? I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. You the hand with that horse? No. Well, <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. That's Jeremiah. Oh, none of that. Okay, Jeremiah. That's there a cute boy. little horse. You done? Come on. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh, calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <laughs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. We're okay. I'm gonna take him out first. Burn some of this heat off of him. I'll be in the corral, Ben. There you are. Nice horse. I'll rock with him. Everything you got, come on. This is a nice horse. I think I like this one. I'll rock with him. Yeah, boy. Yeah, Jeremiah. No, don't stop now. That's my horsey porsey. Got a lot of energy. Jeez. A lot of stamina. There you go. There's your energy. Calm now. <laughs> You'll be all right, man. Get your ass up. Okay. That was fun, wasn't it? <laughs> you can behave now, can't you? <laughs> Just hit him and <laughs> make him hit his head. There you go. Respect me. You will respect me, Horace. You will respect me. For you. Okay. Get on up there and go nice and slow. Good horse. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. My heart's mm. beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Mm. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Good boy. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there ain't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, Good. sir. Can I ask? Are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich. Way richer than Pa. And he's got all these hired guns. 
out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Right. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Now. Yes, sir. Good, 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 good. Don't worry about all that gangster stuff, I homie. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. Hmm. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. Good horse. You, Mr. Milton? Yes. I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. Not I'm anymore. Sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. Fine. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. Put him down. What she need now? Uh, are you coming? I'm right here. So, you know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too much. Oh my God, where does my husband find men like you? I'm you know, the we best. We all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. What's he going to town it's for? Not Escorts? Not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Excuse me. Whatever you say, You want to stick my hand up a horse's ass? Ugh. Woman, why can't you do it? Okay, now hold on. Slip. Oh, slips. Get hold of it again. Oh, I lost it. You lost it? It's coming out one way or another. Grab them again. Hold on. I got it. Find them, Milton. Come on. And pull. Grip them. Hmm. He's struggling. I don't even know what to do. So it says pull up, but. What am I doing? What am, what am I supposed to do? Like. What? I'm confused, bro. Oh, there we go. Got it. It's happening. Okay, well, Give him birth. I think she's. Well, we're not out of the woods, but hmm? I think she may be okay. Okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton. Get your hands off me, man. Feel free to make a call at the house sometime. What? Perhaps even now. A what? drink to toast our new arrival. Whoa, 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 relax. I like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? Yeah, stay away from I me. I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we we have a boy. Why Maybe would you be concerned around? about that? Oh, uh, I'm I'm busy, uh, t too busy for social calls. Of course. Wow. She Good just, day, mm, Mr. Milton. Hmm. That was weird. It's like she wanted me to just go in there and get drunk with her or something. Huh. I'm, I'm going to run into my wife, honey. Help. Some old lady's trying to come on to me. Uh, oh, God. Oh, they got the little pony in the back. Huh. Hey, John. Hey, babe. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Okay. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? Yeah, did you check on him? He's been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. 
Come on. Round to the left. What do you see? Pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Come on, bud. Let's go. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Just fine. No. You're. Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding? Aside from home. I don't know. But maybe that stream. Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. You know? The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident. Okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Confidant. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. Use your legs, homie. There you are. Well done, girl. Hang in there, girl. Good girl. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a See, you can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Keep going. Whoa. Even faster, come on. Fast out. Faster? What's happening? Help! Easy there. Easy there. Get your ass up. What's wrong with him? You okay? Damn. Watch your language. Now he got it. Okay. Yeah, I think so. You'd know it if you weren't. Get back on. Okay. On. He said, what's happening? Right. Let's go again. Where are we going? We can go even quicker. If you say so, sir. Yeah. Nice. Let's see what he says. How do I look? You look good, man. You look good. Keep at it. You're good. Keep at it, kid. Keep at it, kid. Good job, you kid. I'm getting there. I should hope so. All right, let's go a little faster. Now really stick your boot in. If you say so. If you say so. Come on, boy. Yeah. Hold on now. Good. It's perfect. Now he's learning. Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Yes, sir. Jack. Oh, he's right there. Jack doodly do. There goes those missing horses, right? Oh, I wish I had a gun. Oh, I wish I had a gun. Yes. Think you're ready for a little race? I'll be fine. He ain't ready All for right. me. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Oh. Okay, punk. You really think you got it? Uh, no. Kid, give it a rest. 
Oh, what's, what's the matter? You too slow? Oh, your little pony can't do shit. That little pony can't do shit. I should have let him win. All right, let me slow down. I'm gonna let him win. Like a junkie. Oh, my horse is tired now. Yeah. There you go. I'll let him win. You know, father. Gotta let his son have a little pride. Oh, no. He's winning, guys. Oh, this is so hard. Oh, I'm struggling. Boo hoo. Oh, yeah. I'll just follow him around. He beat me. Good job, kid. I beat you. you I did. beat you. You did. I well beat ridden, son. Good job, kid. I beat you. You did. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. Maybe you'll really beat you me mean. one day. Got nothing. I'm broke. What's over there? Let me go over here for one last go around. Somebody shooting something. Oh, bro. <laughs> you want to watch your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> yeah, leave him alone, man. Careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How fancy parents get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. So he had some problems with vermin. Mm. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> you thought. I got him. He don't need no help. Get the crap out of that dude, man. Lucky I didn't kill you, dumbass. Get out of here. You can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Uh huh. Well, how's your wife in the brawl? Excuse me? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. Yeah, we both got a temper. You're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> Let me punch him in the face real quick. What'd you say? What you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. Yeah, and you got a black guy too. <laughs> Man, come back Thank here again. You, Just give me Milton. a gun. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Just give me a gun. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Shut up, you idiot. Get out of here. She's such an idiot. Oh, God. She's an idiot sometimes. Like, give him a break. He's trying to help. Don't you see I'm trying to get a raise here, woman? Jeez. I'm just trying to get a raise, and she's over here talking about why you being an idiot. God damn it. This woman, man. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Hmm. Hmm. Dutch, I'm like, oh, I can't wait to see Dutch, man. Alright, guys. We're going to stop right here. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of um, Red Dead Redemption 2, the epilogue. Yes. And, uh,. Stay tuned because we're going to come up more. And if you're new to the channel, man, and you like these videos, well, subscribe, man. Don't let it stop you from subscribing because we got more videos like this coming. And uh, stay tuned, all right? We out of here. Peace.